hi guys welcome back to lady lee kitchen welcome if you're a first time subscriber welcome if you haven't subscribed yet please go ahead and do so and don't forget to click the notification bell that when another video is short another video is uploaded you will be one of the first to know don't forget to share with your friends and family and go ahead and tell a friend to tell a friend okay i'm gonna do some stew but i'm using vegetable this is papaya i'm using green papaya i'm using some squash and i'm using some pumpkin some carrots and some irish potato um, over here i have a little bit of salt fish boiling up so i'm gonna go ahead and prepare the rest of my ingredients and i'll be right back i'm gonna start with the the papaya green papaya did you know that green papaya tastes good in everything even if you're cooking even if you're cooking um beef it's it's softening make it soft see that's that's the papaya that's the green papaya it's it's not supposed to be full it's supposed to be in between and it's good it softens your meat and it do all that good so guys stay tuned and i'll be right back don't forget to subscribe so guys see i am cutting up my squash not my squash sorry i'm cutting up my green papaya And I'm gonna put this down in coconut milk. Some fresh coconut milk. So guys, I cut my squash up and I'm going to put it over here. I'm just using half, half of it. And then I'm going to prepare my pumpkin. Fish over there cooking cook it. Also boiling up the salt. If you're a vegan, you don't have to add the salt fish. But I'm putting a little bit of salt fish in it just to get the fit the flavor. And I'm also gonna add chickpeas in it too. Tomorrow's Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day to everyone when it comes. Hope you you have a wonderful Mother's Day. Cut it up too fine because 
we don't want it to go out of before everything else. I'm gonna add the the squash in first because not the squash, the um the papaya in first because papaya takes a longer time to cook. So I'm gonna add that. Yes. So guys. Stay tuned and watch me preparing this delicious meal. And I'll be right back. So stay tuned. Okay, guys, I'm going to prepare my natural season now. These are ready to wash. I finish all this and I'm going to wash them when I'm ready. So, I'm going to fix them, um, prepare my natural seasoning. Okay, stay tuned. Okay, guys, in here, I'm going to put some olive oil. Not much, just to burn. Nice seasoning. Right this one. I'm gonna use curry. I'm gonna use this one. So, so sorry. Okay, in here, guys. Oops, a little too far. I have to come a little closer. In here, I have my oil. Let me turn my stove down. I have some curd powder and some turmeric in here and I'm going to place it in the pot and kind of spin it around like so it gets a burn. Let me turn the fan on. Okay. And then here I have some natural, um, some dry seasoning. This is basil and rosemary and I'm also going to add it in in my pot. Uh, and I did not tell you that I'm going to use cook my veggie down in some coconut milk. So I'm going to add some garlic. That smell is so good. And then I am gonna add my natural season. 
which is sweet onion, yellow onion, scallion, thyme, and everything in it. And this is some cilantro that I'm going to leave for last. Okay guys, now you see what's going on in here. I just add a little bit of ginger and stuff. So I'm going to put the papaya first because papaya take longer to cook. So I'm going to put the papaya first. And I'm going to kind of, then I'm going to add in here I have all-purpose seasoning, garlic powder, garlic, um, garlic and onion, and so forth. Whatever seasoning you like, you can use. gonna cook this with some bulgur that's what I'm gonna cook down this with some bulgur so stay tuned stay tuned guys if you're not subscribed yet go ahead and do so it's about time to subscribe and try them nice delicious dish I'm a little bit under the weather today guys so forgive me if I mess, I've been cleaning from yesterday and today. So I um all right guys, see turn up the stove a little bit and I'm gonna cover this and let the the seasoning and whatever else in it and then I'm gonna just drop a little bit of coconut milk in it. So you can go and cook down for now. Stay tuned and watch what I'm going. Okay, guys. Over here, this is where I'm gonna cook my burger. I I thought so. I put a little bit of um, avocado oil in it with some salt. And that's all you need, like two tablespoons full. You don't need more than that. This is creamy tree. my I washed my bulgur I wash it like three times and I'm gonna pour it in the water and as soon as the water it start boiling up I turn down my stove and cover it and let it let it go ahead and cook Guys, hit it you now. Watch what we're going. Look how this butter bubble up, bubble up, bubble up. That's just it right there. So I'm gonna let the papaya cook first, and then I add the rest of my stuff in it. Turn that down. I'm gonna get into this. 
going to add my pumpkin and stuff it in there. And then I'm going to season it up. All my good seasoning. And then I'm going to add my coconut milk. So it's cold. And to simmer down, simmer down. See? Look at that. See that? So everything is going to cook down. Then when it's cooked down now, then I will put my chia peas in it. And then that would be it. With some... With some... Um, mm. You just taste good in it, and I'm adding my my cilantro into it also, and let it go on a steam down and cook, and it should be ready maybe another 25 minutes or so. So everything is gonna cook down in coconut milk, and then. I'm gonna add my salt fish as soon as this boil up. I will add my salt fish and the salt fish is just to give it a little bit of flavor. If you're vegan, you can go ahead and do it how you want it, but guys look for a one. Look what I'm going in a lady in the kitchen. Look at that precious veggie stew. Ah, and you know, I'm never adding a no, guys. My protein, my chia peas. That's my chia peas. Come, you can't eat pepper. Can you see that beauty right there? Anyhow, you can do this. If you have two fish, you just throw it on top and make it go and steam down. Anything at all. This is a no meat recipe. So guys, stay tuned and watch where I'm going. That is it, guys. That is it. See? All the veggie. And you can even use this to make a sandwich, eat it with bread, whatever you choose. See how rich that is? Guys, if you're watching this video and you haven't subscribed yet, please go ahead and do so. And that's my bulgur, which is finished. So guys, when I dish it out, I will let you see it. But right now, it's almost done. Need like about another five minutes to make sure everything is done. So I will be right back. This is the finished touch of my stew, papaya, pumpkin, squash, carrots, chickpeas with bulgur rice. Try it and tell me what you think. Guys, if you haven't subscribed yet, do 
please do so and go ahead and subscribe and please share tell a friend to tell a friend to sub subscribe to lady lee kitchen and decor thank you very much have a blessed day